Deirdre from Mobility Genie. At Mobility Genie, we're often asked for a lightweight attendant wheelchair. Lightweight in order to facilitate the carer getting it in and out of the car more easily. So here we have a day's swift self-propelling wheelchair. It's got a lightweight aluminium frame and the seat and back are padded with padded fixed armrests. And now, just to show you a few more features. I'm going to turn it around like so. So your, your hand grips are very comfortable to use. They're molded in that way. And you've got brakes attached to this wheelchair. Because it's an attendant wheelchair, it's an added bonus especially when you're walking down a hill and you want to control the speed. So you just pull, pull the brakes lightly to control your speed as you go along. As you go down the arms of the wheelchair, you can see that you've got two little handles here at the back and that's to allow you to fold down the back. And in particular, that's of use when you're actually putting it in and out of the car or when you're storing it because it just makes it store nice and easily. I find when you're taking a wheelchair apart, you've got a bar on either side of the seat of the wheelchair and if you tilt the chair ever so slightly and give it a push, it takes a lot of the pressure off your back when you're managing a wheelchair. You can see with this wheelchair, because it's an attendant wheelchair, you've got a seat belt. It helps the person feel safer. And then at the bottom, you've got two little grips here. That would be to assist the carer when getting on and off a footpath. By putting their weight on it, it allows the front wheels to go up onto the footpath. You can see the front wheels are swivel and the back wheels are, made, are solid so that you don't have to pump them. And that's easy maintain. So then going along the front of the wheelchair there, you'll see the two footrests, which can be easily swung back on both sides. And you must remember to do that when you're getting a person on and off the wheelchair in order for it not to break the skin or cause harm. The other thing to remember is you always have to put on the brakes when a person is getting on and off the wheelchair. So you put on both brakes when the person is getting on and you put on both brakes when the person is getting off. And now you're ready to motor along again. And just while I'm talking about the brakes, I slow myself down as I'm walking, but if I want to stop the wheelchair from here, in other words, put on the brakes, you simply pull the brake right up towards you and push this button here to the front and it puts it into a locked position. So you can see that at the front of the wheelchair. And to to unlock them, all you do is pull it up and let it go. Now I'm just going to show you how to remove the footrest from the wheelchair. So you just take it off like so. On the frame of the chair, you've got two buttons and on the footrest of the chair, you've got two holes. So you align the holes onto the buttons, slip them down over and lock it into place. So that's the day's swift attendant wheelchair.